Lesson 7.2, Count and Write 11 and 12. We can model 11 as a full 10 frame and one more below it. 11 is one greater than 10. 11 is 10 and one more. This is the number 11. This is the word 11. E-L-E-V-E-N. We can model 12 as a full 10 frame with two counters below. 12 is 2 greater than 10. 12 is 10 and 2 more. This is the number 12. This is the word 12. T W E L V E. We can write the number 11 with our right hand. We start up at the top line and we go straight down to the bottom line. And we make another one starting at the top line and go straight down to the bottom line. It looks like two ones next to each other. That's 11. We can write the word 11, E-L-E-V-E-N. We can write it with our right hand. We start here in between the dashed line and the bottom line. And we pull towards our hand and we go up and around for the E. We make a L. We make another E. We make a V. We make another E. And we finish with an N. We come down and bounce around. 11. We can write the number 12 and the word 12 with our right hand. For the number 12, we start at this top line and we go straight down to make a one. And then we have a two next to it. And this two starts here. We come up and around, down to the bottom line and pull towards our hand. Okay, we have a one with a two next to it. For 12, we have a T-W-E-L-V-E. -E. We start by making our T. We start here, just above the dash line, and come straight down. We go on the left side and pull towards our hand to cross the T. We make a W. We start here at the dash line and come down and up and down and up. We make a E. We start here and pull towards our hand and come up and around. We make a L. Now we make a V. It's on a slant down and then on a slant up and then we finish it with another E. Come across and around. We have the number 12 and the word 12. We can write the number 11 and the word 11 with our left hand. For the left-handed students, we start at the top line up here and we go straight down to the bottom line. And we need to put another one next to it. Start up here and come straight down. We have two ones that are next to each other. That's the number 11. We can write the word 11, E-L-E-V-E-N. We start here and we go away and around. We make a L, looks just like a one. We make another E, we push away and come around. We make a V, comes down on a slant and up on a slant. We make another E, push away and go around, and we make a N. We start at the dash line, come down and bounce around. 11. 
we can write the number 12 and the word 12 with our left hand for the left hand students. We need a one with a two next to it. We make the one by starting here and going straight down. We make the two by starting here, going up and around on a slant and then going across. 12. We can write the word 12, T-W-E-L-V-E. -E. We start here above the dash line, come down. We go on the right side and pull it towards our hand. That's the T. We make a W. We make an E. We make an L. We make a V. We make another E. 12. We have the number 12 and the word 12. These are the numbers to 12 in counting order. You want to count with me? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11, 12. We have 10, 11, 12. 10, 11, 12. 11 is 10 and one more. 11 in all is equal to 10 plus 1. 12 is 10 and 2 more. 12 in all is equal to 10 plus 2. When we look at the numbers 10, 11, 12, we see that this is a 1 with a 0 next to it. This is a 1 with a 1 next to it. This is a 1 with a 2 next to it. They all have a 1. And for 10, 11, 12, we have a 0 next to it, a 1 next to it, a 2 next to it. Do you know what the next number would be? It would start with a 1. And if we've got a 0, then a 1, then a 2, it would have a 3 next to it. They all have a 1, and then they start going up in counting order for the numbers next to it. 1, 2, 3, and we could keep going. And that would be 13. Here, we have a full 10 frame with leaves in it. There are 10 leaves. We have 10 leaves and one more leaf. We have 10 and one more. That's 10, 11. And we can write 10 plus 1 for one more is equal to 11 in all. Remember the word and tells us to add and to use a plus symbol. On the left side here, we have some numbers. We need to choose and circle one of the numbers, any number we want. I think I'll choose 12. That's a nice number. Now we need to count the pumpkins. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. There are ten pumpkins. We need to draw more pumpkins to match whichever number we picked. Now I picked twelve, so we need to draw more pumpkins so we'll have twelve. Ten, and we can draw another pumpkin. And put a little stem on it and draw another pumpkin. That's 11 and another pumpkin would be 12. We had to draw two more pumpkins. 12, we can write the addition equation. 12 is equal to 10 plus two more. And we can write the 12 first, 
then the equal sign and 10 plus 2. Or we could write 10 plus 2 first, like that. And it's equal to 12. So remember, we can write an addition equation either way with the number in all and then equals, or the numbers we're adding together then equals the number in all. Our next lesson, 7.3, we're going to model and count 13 and 14. I'm proud of you for watching math videos and doing math, and I hope I'll see you next time. Bye.